my gosh. This is, this is one of those days, man. Yo, yo, yo. Doro, Risa, yo. Fully camp. What's that word? What's that word? What's that word? It's one of those mornings, man. It's one of those mornings. When is it, it ever one of those mornings when you're dealing with these dogs? You know what I mean? Um... I'm honestly, I'm, I'm, I'm frustrated right now. You know what I'm saying, y'all. Um, sometimes, you know, your dog do that to you. Sometimes your dog frustrates you, man. Sometimes your dog make you mad. Sometimes all of that happens. But one thing for certain, two things for sure. You know, it happens. You know, at a time that you don't feel like it happening, man. But at the same time, y'all. You know what I'm saying? By the title of this video, you know what I'm saying? Um, the answer is no. Do not ask me to pet my dog. The answer is no. Okay? If I let you... Stop! If I let you pet my dog, then I let you pet my dogs. But you know, when you got this breed, man, and you know, people, first thing they want to do is Oh my God, I love these dogs. They don't. They really just want to see if you a shitty person and if you train your dog to be people aggressive. Because people don't know that technically bully breeds are really, they love humans. They love people. So, you know, as long as you socialize them, get them desensitized, get them to understand the different sounds of the world, and get them accustomed to, you know, different things, then they're not going, they're not going to have those problems, okay? They're not going to have those problems, and that's the truth. But if I'm in tractor supply, no, you cannot pet my dogs. If I'm at the vet, no, you cannot pet my dogs. If I'm walking down the street, no, you cannot pet my dogs. I don't know you, I don't want to know you, they don't need to know you, and I don't want you petting my dogs. So, you see this? If you want a dog, it's a million and one puppies for sale. It's a million and one dogs at the shelter. Okay? Go get you one and pet it all you want. You, you don't have to worry about nobody saying no. You ain't got to worry about asking because you got your own dog to pet. I don't understand. People at the vet got their own dogs, German Shepherds, Beagles, all types of things. Bully Breeds, Kanye Corsos, Rottweilers, all types of things. Got their own dogs. And the next thing you know, what they want to do is they want to ask you, can, you pet, can they pet your dog? No, you cannot pet my dog. Come on. No. I don't want your hands on my dog because I don't want to pet your dog. You know what I'm saying? I never ask somebody, can I pet their dog? Okay? So why are you asking me to pet mine? It's one of the most annoying questions. Especially if you've got a bully, and especially, you know, uh, you, you, you got puppies. They want to pet them. No! You know, I, I, I walk the dogs and people ride next to me. Oh my God, are they friendly? Can I pet them? I'll be like, no, they're not friendly. Get away. No. You know what I'm saying? They friendly with who they need to be friendly for, man. They're not friendly for you. Move. Get away. Like who, like, who does that? You know what I'm saying? Who does that? Like, I, I don't never understand. Like, I never understood that, man. Like, what, what, do, what do I need to ask you to pet your dog for? Even when I didn't have dogs, it was a point in time and I went through a little stretch. I didn't even have a dog. I never walked past or walked in the store and said, can I pet your dog? Can I pet your dog? I never did that, y'all. I never did that. So by the title, the answer is no. When you see Doro Riccio, no, you cannot pet my dog. Okay, if we in a dog setting, you know, if we went to some shows, you know, if we went to some places, you know, where, you know, you got to pet your dog and, you know, other people is a meet and greet for dogs and all that, then yeah, 
you can pet my dog. But if I'm in tractor supply and I'm just getting food, I got one of my puppies with me, leave me alone. No, you can't pet my dog. No, you cannot pet my dog. You should have a puppy of your own that you want to pet. You should have a puppy of your own that you want. This is what you should have. But this is what I'm not going to do. This is what I'm not going to do. I am not going to ask you to pet your puppy. I'm not going to ask you that. Okay? So don't ask me to pet mine. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, pet smart, track the supply, all those things. Don't ask me to do that. Don't ask me to do that. Okay? That's one of the things I'm not going to do. Don't ask me to do that because I'm not going to do it. Okay? I'm going to say no every time. And the answer is going to stay no every time. We in the show. Something like that? Yes. You know what I'm saying? We had a meet and greet. We hold a a dog get together or, you know, AKC, you know, bully show or anything. Yeah, you can pet my dog. You can pet my dog. Other than that, no, you cannot pet my dog. So it's one of those things where, you know, I'm going to keep reiterating that. No, you cannot pet my dogs. You understand? That's how that go. So, you know, I'm having puppy issues right now. That's why I'm frustrated. I can't keep nothing out of their mouths. Like, I can't keep nothing out of their mouth. And it's mainly this one. I cannot keep nothing out of her mouth. And you know what I'm saying? Like, it's unfortunate, but I'm not spending a fortune on another dog. You understand what I'm saying? You to get a foreign body because you being dumb, that's on you. I'm, on, I'm going to either surrender you or put you down. I'm not paying for no surgery, man. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I refuse to do it. I'll do a surgery that, you know, you hurt your leg, you know, you need a surgery to live. I'll do it. Other than that, I'm not doing it. I am not doing it. I refuse. You know what I'm saying? So this one just keep on picking up something. Like, you know, Bane chilling. Bane chill. It's this one. It's this one. And I can't keep nothing out of her mouth. Look, I can't keep nothing out of her mouth. So at the end of the day, hey, look, you get sick. You get very sick, that's on you, man. That's on you. I, I done tried everything in the world that I know on training dogs to not pick up nothing out on the street, and it doesn't work. Bane gets it. So I know I know how I know what I'm doing, but this is just a dumb dog. This is a dumb dog, bro. Like, I love her to death, but she's stupid. She's a really, really dumb dog. And it gets on my nerves. It's very annoying. But you know what I mean? I just wanted to make that video, man. I'm about to get up out of here. It's Doro. I'm out.